Rolling. Okay, uh, I've got these modules here. They're my own design, calling them misguided modules, and they are the SSI 2131 based VCOs. So two of them here, uh, one complete VCO each, based on the SSI 2131 chip by Sound Semiconductor. Um, they're pretty close to the reference design, uh, very few deviations uh, from what they suggest in the data sheet. In this demo, I'm going to be using a single loop of, uh, you know, a, a fairly simple pattern, uh, so that the only thing that you need to really listen to is the timbre. So I think we should be starting the pattern relatively soon. So yes, this is in fairly default mode. I've got maths here functioning as an envelope generator, and I've got a simple VCA to act as, well, a VCA. Um, filter is not currently used. This demo is focusing just on the oscillator. So what I can do is obviously I can detune it. Which is fine. Um, I can do coarse detune. And if I knew how to tune things properly, you know, that might actually sound good. Um, the other thing I can do is, uh, you know, obviously it has different outputs, so I can do pulse in one of these. That's a nice pulse. In fact, I think that's number one. Right now, we're listening only to the uh, square oscillator, the one I'm using the square output from. And it can do PWM quite nicely, so let me boost up the volume and listen to that. Even to cancellation. And the other way as well. Obviously the, uh, the best way to use this is uh, it's with a LFO doing pulse width modulation, but you don't have to. What if I take one of these guys unpatch some things and actually use the triangle output of the lower tune oscillator as pulse width modulation of the higher pitch oscillator and that's starting to sound kind of wild that's starting to sound almost chip tuney i like that this is nice you can do. You can do a uh, soft and hard sync, so this is, uh, this would be hard sync. Let's actually switch that to pulse here. This is kind of weird. Soft sync is slightly more interesting. Um, let's see how the soft sync sounds on a triangle output. Now, triangle is much quieter. No, 
Now that's slightly more interesting, isn't it? That doesn't sound like as a soul. Triangle again. You can get some interesting effects here. Um, what if I take the triangle there and route it to the linear FM of this guy? Now, linear FM isn't, you know, straight up FM like you would uh, you would find on a Yamaha DX series. But it's kind of close. Yeah, you can you can get some interesting effects here as well. So that's the pulse with the linear FM going. So let's uh, let's patch this uh, as a let's patch them in parallel again. Um, so CV goes into both of them. And this guy goes into this one. Let's do parallel saw just like before. And then this guy is here. So here you have this, you know, rather fat soul sound. Um, it, I think it sounds pretty good. Uh, let's let's pause for a second and run it through a filter. If I pause, I mean don't pause, cause you know, it doesn't matter. Now, of course, filters are kind of useful to via envelopes as well, so, uh, might as well use this, uh, buffer multiple to send CV both to the filter and to the VCA. Um, by the way, the filter is also one of my designs, currently uh, working on a slightly more production-ready version. And this is, uh, I mean, it's a bog standard collection of simple op-amp circuits, but it's also something I designed myself. May or may not include that in any sort of future commerce endeavors. Thank you. 
so that's just one of them. Uh, just this one. Both of them again. And then this one. And one of them. Pulse is very powerful here. It's it's great. It's also amazing to put some you know high resonance uh, on a pulse wave. I think that's all I have for this demo, so, uh, you know. If you are in any way interested in this, um, I guess drop me a line, because uh, I don't know if I should start selling these or, or what. Maybe I'll, you know, next production run. Uh, I, I have to order in at least five, so I might give away a couple. Um, but yeah, this is, uh, this has been a quick demo of the misguided modules uh, VCO powered by the sound semiconductor SSI 2131. Um, thank you very much for listening, watching, consuming the content. Um, cheers.